Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It's Connor here. Welcome back. Hope you're all enjoying your day so far. So I've got a few new candle reviews to share with you guys today, and we're going to kick it off with a Hallmarks candle. This is the Harvest Bake Shop candle. Now I've actually already done a review of this scent. I purchased this last year when it initially released last fall, and I actually had it in the three wick version. It's not the um, three wick that is shaped like this, but it's that three wick that has the white glass. Um, I'm honestly not a fan of that style from Homeworks. I don't find the performance to be great on those. Um, I didn't like the wicks. The strength of the bra wasn't great for me. So I honestly prefer these four wicks from Homeworks. They are definitely my preferred version from them. So when Homeworks um, sent this one to me in PR, I was really excited. Um, because I really liked this scent last year. I just didn't get a great performance out of this one. Um, so yes, in full disclosure, this was sent in PR by Homeworks. Thank you to Homeworks for sending this one. Um, occasionally with their influencers, affiliates, ambassador program, they will send us some scents to review. So when they sent this one, I was really happy. Um, I was planning on picking this up in the four wick either ways because I did want to give it another chance and burn it this year in the four wick um because this is a really delicious scent you guys and probably one of my new um favorite new releases from them so far this fall so yeah we're going to talk all about it before we get into the actual review i do want to let you guys know about the sale going on at homeworks.shop today which is actually now called um slatkinandco.com yeah that's what it's called now so homeworks did change the name um basically the reason for that was so that they could add more products other than just the homeworks candles to the uh slatkin and co website so i think that they're maybe going to start incorporating some of the scent work stuff and some of the other brands under the Slatkin & Co. Um, name. So anyways, there's that little update. But the sale for today, um, the promo is buy one get one 60% off, which brings the candles down to about um, $21 each. I did the math there. Um, you cannot use um, affiliate promos or any, or sorry, affiliate codes or any of your rewards which is really frustrating, but um, Homeworks is doing a little bit of changes on the website and you are no longer able to use the uh, codes and the um, rewards that you have on every sale. There will be some sales that they're allowed to be used um, and we'll let you know when that is available. But for this sale, you cannot stack your discount codes or your um, rewards. I understand the discounts for some of the uh, sales, but the rewards code just really frustrates me because rewards are really something that you should be able to use at any time that you would like because you know you're paying for those rewards basically and so they're supposed to be an incentive so it is really frustrating but I did just want to let you guys know that the codes will not work on today's sale um so yeah it's buy one get one 60 percent off that is site-wide so it's not just on candles it's going to be on everything site-wide um there's also free shipping at 40 dollars that should automatically ring up in your cart so spend 40 and you'll get free shipping um so definitely um, spend 40 if you're going to place an order, get your free shipping. Um, I don't know if I'm going to place an order yet. I was going to because there are a few new things that I'll talk about in a minute that do spark my interest, but um, I don't know. I'm still thinking because I do um, maybe want to wait for a better sale because um, this is a good sale, but I'm waiting for one where I can maybe use um, an ambassador code because, yes, I do use an ambassador code. So just like you guys, I'm waiting for the best deal, but there are some new releases, so I may be making an order today. Um, the new releases, there are, um, first off, plug-in diffusers are now on the website. So they have the cloud plug-in device and they have... The refills of hot cider donut, limoncello cupcake, harvest leaves, and spiced pumpkin. Those will come in a four pack um, of refills. And then the candles include lakeside foliage, cinnamon sugar marshmallow, crackling fireside, crisp apple cider, cozy weekend, midnight leaves fall chrysanthemum and patchouli teakwood. I believe the only new one there is patchouli teakwood. And I think that. Um, 
lakeside foliage might be new as well so um i do want to pick a few of those up to review for you guys so and also lux um lux candle in the 50 ounce is going to be birchwood vanilla is now on there which is a fabulous scent so if you like that scent it is now going to be available in the lux but anyways guys that is the long intro there let's actually get into this candle itself the harvest bake shop all right, so um, I'll link this one if you are interested in shopping, but um, your notes here are creamy pumpkin, crushed gingerbread, sugared molasses, and whipped buttercream. And this is a really, really delicious scent, you guys. I really like this one. Um, this is kind of like your basic fall bakery type scent, but basic in a good way. Like it's the basic that we all love. It's that pumpkin spice goodness. It just smells amazing. Um, so I do get that creamy pumpkin in here. It is definitely a spiced pumpkin. I wouldn't consider this to be like an overly spicy scent. Like I don't pick up clove in here. I don't pick up a ton of spices. Um, for the spice that I do get in here, I think it's maybe a little bit of nutmeg and maybe a warm cinnamon. It's definitely not red hot. It is definitely your warmer bakery cinnamon, um, but you do get that creamy um, pumpkin in there. There is a gingerbread note in here, which I think kind of puts a fun twist on it. I really like the gingerbread that I get in here and it mixes really well with that molasses note. Um, I believe, yeah, molasses is made, or molasses is in gingerbread and it's one of the key ingredients that make gingerbread. So it's kind of like a mixture of pumpkin and gingerbread. And then you get this creamy vanilla buttercream in here, which kind of gives it a sweetness. Um, it's really, really delicious. Now, there are some apples on this label, which kind of confused me because I really don't get apple in here. It's not even listed in the notes either. This is a creamy pumpkin scent with a gingerbread to it. It's not an overly done gingerbread. It's kind of more of a subtle gingerbread in my opinion. I think I know that sometimes gingerbread can throw some people off. I really like gingerbread and the gingerbread in here is nice. It's not um, overly done. The ginger is not too strong. It blends in really well with the pumpkin and the creaminess of that vanilla. So I really like this scent, you guys. This is a great, great fall gourmand scent. And if you just kind of want like one of those classic fall candles that um, Homeworks is really good at making, then I think that this is a great option for that. Um, I'm really, really enjoying this one. And you guys, it's a good performer as well, which is a double thumbs up because I've definitely had some performance issues as of late with homework. So this one being a good performer is really a relief. Um, I just think that it's really annoying and frustrating with the inconsistencies of homeworks. Like I've had a lot that have done well and I've also had a lot that have not done well. So I don't really know what I'm going to get with them when I burn the candle. So I kind of just have to cross my fingers and hope that the burn is going to be well. And like I said, for this one, it is. So um, I'll go ahead and give you guys an overhead view. Here is your overhead view. Um, I have been burning this for about three hours now. So this is going to get blown out after this video. But the burn is doing so good, you guys. Um, starting with the wicks, the wicks are doing great. Um, one of the biggest problems that I've had with the homework scandals lately is just puny wicks that either fall over or just dud out and get super puny and they're just they don't want to stay alive and that leads to pooling issues low strength of throw it leads to a lot of different issues but this one is doing really well um i actually have been having to trim these wicks um because they are getting a little bit of that carbon residue which you do need to snip off so you don't get sootiness and the burn is doing good um as you can tell in the pool of wax there is a slight um carbon like residue that's gone into the wax it's just little pieces of the wick which is not a big deal it hasn't really affected the fragrance or done anything like that so really happy with the performance on this one um, i'm also really impressed with the strength and throw the strength and throw for this one has been like a solid six and a half for me um which is not a ton but for homeworks that's pretty good considering it is a four wick candle um i would say with a hurricane i get about a six and a half um 
I've been burning this one with my Hurricane for the entire time. And it does pretty good for strength and throw in there. It's not a house filler, but it is a room filler. And I can smell it when I walk in. I've been alternating this one in between my kitchen and the um, entryway. And it's just been a really delightful scent to have going. And it performs really nicely in my Hurricane. Um, so yeah, I'm really happy with this um, one. I'm really happy with this candle. The scent, the performance is great. So um, I'll give it a two thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts on Harvest Bake Shop from Homeworks down below in the comments. I would love to hear what you all think of this one. Make sure to check out the Homework sale if you're interested in shopping today, either from the new releases or some of these older fragrances as well. I'll leave a link for homeworks.shop down below. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think of this scent and if you're going to be shopping today's deals. Thank you so much for watching. Please like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!